family was hurt. JJ, my family was hurt too. My house was blown up while I was away. Oh no, Mikey. We need to help them urgently. We need them to wake up. I do not know. It is necessary to give them something from which they will wake up. I think I know what will help them. I need to see if it's still at my house. I have rotten flesh on the second floor of my house. It just stinks terribly. If you give them a sniff of it, they will definitely wake up. Ugh, rotten meat. It's just terrible. Why do you keep it in your house? As you can see, it came in handy, so I keep it for a reason. What are we going to do if it doesn't help? We'll have to take them to the hospital, and if someone hurts them there too. This should help. Don't worry, Mikey. Everything will be fine. Let your family smell it. They'll definitely slip it in, and then we'll decide what to do next. What happened? Why does it stink so terribly? We were attacked, and the house was blown up. Mikey's house was also blown up. We need to leave urgently before anything happens again. JJ, we're going huh? to follow you in the car, too. We're not going to stay here. We'll go to another village where they can protect us. Yes. I'll take care of it. We'll follow you. Okay, then it's time to hit the road. Where are we going? And who is trying to harm us? Don't worry, no one will hurt you anymore. Fasten your seatbelts, we'll be there soon. We are going to a nearby village. There is very good security there. We've arrived. Don't go far, I'll arrange everything myself. It doesn't look like a village with super cool protection. This is what she is. He lives a very cool man. He has what we need. We are ready to go to this village. Fine, then follow me. Are you sure this is a good idea? We have no other choice. We need any protection. Hmm. Welcome to my village. How can I help you? We need better protection. We were attacked, and my family was hurt. I have what you need, but it will cost a lot hmm. of diamonds. What kind of protection will there be? And is there any chance that you won't deceive us? Believe me, you can't find better protection anywhere in the area. You will be protected by my guards. Anyone who tries to attack you will be killed. Okay, we have diamonds. I'll give them to you. What should we do? We don't have diamonds, so we'll be unguarded. And where should we go? Without diamonds, I won't help you. Only JJ's family. They paid me. So, well, come on. I'll show you your protection. My village is very rich. My golems will protect you. And there will also be a wall that will not allow anyone to get to you. With this lever, a wall with spikes will rise. No one can pass through it. Not even zombies and creepers. No one. That's just fine. So, I'll make sure we're safe. JJ, it's just amazing. It's very beautiful here, and the defense is cool, but what should we do? I'm sorry, Mikey, but I don't have any more diamonds. I took everything I had at home. You should have thought about taking the diamonds, too. This village looks much better than the old one. There is even a market here. You won't have to go far. Let's go see what kind of house we're going to have. I can't wait anymore. I also want to see, let's go soon. I wonder how many rooms there will be. They even built it in our world, the red house as it was before. True, the old house was bigger, but that's okay. The main thing is that we are protected. Where did Mikey go? He probably built a house behind a fence because he doesn't have diamonds. Let's see what he does. Hmm. Hey, Mikey, what are you doing? Huh? I built a house for my family. It certainly wasn't very cool, but that's all I could do. And I also made a sword to defend myself. Huh? How do you like my house? Oh, Mikey, it doesn't look very sturdy, and it's very small. Then why did you come if you don't like it? So go to your rich house. Okay, Mikey. I have to go. I'll meet you later. I need to check on my family. How hot it is outside. Hmm. Oh, is it raining? I still haven't checked how my family is doing. This rain started to fall very suddenly. It's strange. There is also thunder. This is a bad sign. I hope lightning does not strike our house. What? The golems are holding a canopy for us so that it doesn't rain. It's very cool. It's just amazing here, JJ. Look at how much food they brought us. And the golems are also holding a canopy so that <gasps> the rain doesn't drip on us. Wow. And that's it for us. It's really cool. There's even Coca-Cola here. I feel like a rich man. I wish it would always be like this. Not like Mikey. It's such a small house there. I do not know how they all fit there. By the way, I need to go see how they are. Well, did lightning strike his house? They don't even have any protection. Or their house has already been flooded with water. The rain is heavy enough. Hmm. Everything seems to be fine. Oh, shit. They were struck by lightning after all. That's how it is. Why exactly did lightning strike my house? Am I so unlucky? It's good that at least everyone is alive. And I will repair the house tomorrow morning. What a nightmare. Oh, poor Mikey. He was just lucky that lightning struck his house. But I don't know how to help him. We urgently need to tell the family everything. They will be shocked. There, Mikey's house was struck by lightning. And their house caught fire. But everyone was alive. And that's good. How can a house keep burning when it rains? It doesn't extinguish at all. Oh my god, why can't everything be okay? I hope the water helps. I won't let my family get hurt. 
What's that noise outside? I can't sleep properly. What? A tornado? First, the thunder and lightning, and now the tornado. And how do we deal with it? Even our fence won't help us. It's right outside Mickey's house. He's definitely not going to be well. Mikey, come here quickly. There's a tornado here. What should we do? It's near our house. Oh my god. What kind of day is it today? And what should we do now? I do not know how to get rid of it. We also need to do something. We need to go to the main thing that he put a fortification on the fence, or we will all be sucked into a tornado. Oh, it seems that the fence has become clearly higher, and it looks strong enough. I need to see what's going on with Mikey. Oh, no. It seems things are bad. Mikey's family was sucked into a tornado. Yeah! Help us. Someone please help us. Mikey, I don't know how to help you. If I come over, I'll get sucked in, too. We need to tell the family. Maybe they know how to help them. It's a pity that I don't have any more diamonds. No one will want to help for free. I don't have any ideas at all. There's a huge tornado, and Mikey's family got sucked into it. We have to help them. We can't help them in any way. If we go to them, we'll get sucked in there, too. We just have to wait for the tornado to calm down, and they'll be free. Maybe you're right. I can't draw by myself. You should be safe. I'll go to bed, then. I'm too tired today. How hot it is today! All residents are hiding from the heat under umbrellas. Even the foliage on the trees has dried up. What a heat it is outside. I need to cool down urgently and as soon as possible. Otherwise, I will be left with a puddle of red color because of my clothes. Oh yes, it's so good. But something is missing. I need to get something to drink. It's just a pity that my family drank all my cold Coca-Cola. Let's leave these drinks in the shade. I hope they cool down a little. Great, you can relax and drink your drink. It's a pity that it's already warm because of the heat. Now, we need to check on Mikey. He probably feels very bad because of the heat. What is he doing there? Oh, I see a sea chew. Oh, all right. What? Are they swimming in a puddle? Are they swimming in a puddle? Oh, poor Mikey's family. What's that in Mikey's hand? Is it a water lily? But why does he need it? Is he watering them for her? What a horror. We need to help Mikey cope with the heat a little bit today. Can I give him some drinks? No, he will drink them in a minute, and there will be nothing left. We need to come up with something else. Hmm, should I give him an umbrella? It's like an umbrella. It's a great idea, so he can hide from the sun. I think Mikey will be very happy with this news. I need to take some earth to climb over my big steep fence. I can't wait to see Mikey's face when I give him my umbrella. Mikey's family will definitely be happy with... Hey, Mikey, I've got a present for you. Oh, LJ, what is it? This is Mikey's umbrella to make you feel good in this heat today. Thanks, JJ. Yes. Okay, Mikey, it's time for me to go swim in my cool jacuzzi in my cool house. Bye, Mikey. I've done one good thing. Now I can go rest. Otherwise, I'm going to melt from this heat. We need to cool down urgently. Otherwise, I'll turn into a red slime. Ha <laughs> ha! My family is cooling off, and I need to go to them too. Faster! Oh, great! How good I'm gonna sit like this all day until it gets dark. I need to check what's going on there. My defenders should be able to easily deal with a bunch of monsters. But what will Mikey come up with? He doesn't have such cool defenders like me. Maybe he'll hide underground and wait until morning comes. It seems the zombie wanted to break through here, but he was stopped. Oh, good job, Golem. Keep it up. Don't let that zombie go. Wow, how he beats this zombie professionally. The punch is well placed. We need to check what's on the other wall. Fine. My defenders aren't working well. It's not for nothing that I pay them. It seems the zombies wanted to break my cars, but nothing like that. My guards dealt with them. Oh, Mikey chose a different strategy. He just hit on his roof from the zombies. It may help, but for a short time, soon the zombies will get to him anyway. You need to help Mikey's poor family before it's too late. No! Mikey, you won't be able to intimidate them with an ordinary wooden sword. They are as stupid as you think. You need a more serious weapon here. Yes, Golem. Set the heat on this zombie. Show Mikey what protection should be. Haha, <laughs> how helpless Mikey is. I need to help him urgently. Otherwise, who will I compete with later, Mikey? Wait a bit. I'll figure it out now. Where was my weapon lying there in case of a zombie apocalypse? Great. Here's the weapon. You need to run faster to Mikey's family before she gets eaten by these evil zombies. Bear with me a little, Mikey. I'm already running. I have so many bullets, I think there should be enough for all the zombies. I'll take a sniper position. I won't let you hurt, Mikey. You're my friend, and friends always recognize each other in trouble. Who's shooting? Zombies are dying. We are saved. 
Mikey doesn't see me, then I'll tell him that I was the savior of his family. Even though he lives poorly, I don't care. We're friends. Mikey's whole house is broken. I'm very sorry for him. I just don't know how else to help him. Maybe Ben will stay together and we'll live under protection. Or maybe he should be given the resources to build himself a better defense because a wooden fence is a very Yay! poor defense. Oh my god, there are no more zombies. We are safe. We can go down from the roof. It's safe here. I checked everything. Mikey's going to be surprised when I tell him who killed all the zombies. Hey Mikey, how do you like the zombie apocalypse? Is everyone alive? JJ, did you kill all the zombies that surrounded us? Thank you very much. Take this weapon to protect your family. Wow, thanks a lot! <laughs> I have to go back to my family while Mikey... I did a lot of useful things today. I think Mikey and I are real friends. Now he can protect his family. Let's see what awaits us tomorrow. What's happening? What kind of sounds do I hear? Mm, is it that villager has opened a new competition? Come on up. Come on, everyone. I'm holding a contest to see who's the strongest. Will you be able to pass this obstacle course? The main prize is a treasure of diamonds and emeralds. Wow, I have to go through this obstacle course. But who am I going to compete with? No one seems to want to get the grand prize. But I think I know who wants to. I need to get Mikey to compete with me. We're jumping over the fence again, because that way I'll get to Mikey faster. I'm sure he'll like this idea. Hey, Mikey. Do you want to compete on the obstacle course with me? The main prize is a treasure of gold, diamonds, and emeralds. Can you imagine? Wow, JJ, this is great news. Of course I want to. We can get rich and I won't live here anymore. Do And who will be my opponent? Of course I'm Mikey. I'm not going to give up. Oh, but I'm still going to fight to the end. I have to win. Now or never. Nikki's great attitude. I say right away, without cheating, we play fair. Everything will be fair. Of course it will be a pity if I don't win. But it's just a game and everything will be fair. Oh, is this parkour? I'm really bad with parkour. I'm definitely going to lose. Don't get upset ahead of time, Mikey. Maybe you'll win, and I'll lose. Well, Mikey, let's run one, two... Wait, guys. Be careful. I don't want to pay for your treatment later. Haha. -ha. I won't need any treatment, but I don't know about Mikey. You'll need to be treated later if you talk like that. Okay, Mikey. No offense. It's just a joke. I just wanted to cheer you up. Okay. I'm not offended, but don't say that anymore. Okay, Mikey. I'm sorry. You can't even jump over the first blocks. Let's push up the t-shirts. Otherwise, I'll get the prize and you won't be able to move to this village. Oh, I didn't want to move in with you. I'd rather build myself a cool house and a fence and buy myself ten times more pools than you have. Ha, LJ. It seems I'm going to be the first now. Only in your dream, Mikey. You move like a turtle. Oh, right. You are a turtle. You see, I beat you to it in two counts, and you keep crawling like a snail. Ha 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 ha. I'm going to overtake you anyway. The prize will go to me, and only me, and you keep sitting in your jacuzzi. Yes, Mikey. The competition is called Who's Stronger? And I'm stronger than you, so I'm going to win. And I will win, honestly, so that you understand who is better and stronger here. Who would say Mikey? Oh, I couldn't get through. I need to get through faster than Mikey, because I'm the best here. Great, it worked out. Mikey will never get over it. Ha ha. Come on, Mikey. You're not in a hurry to get first. I'm already at the finish line. I have two steps to take here. Be patient for a while. I'll catch up with you now and see which one of us will laugh. Ha ha, Mikey. I told you, you're not going to get through this. And now I'm going to get my prize. And no one will stop me. Oh, no. I need to get back in before Mikey gets ahead of me. Yeah, JJ, I'm already going for my prize. You can't stop me, ha ha. Mikey, the one who laughs the last laughs. I'm the first one again, and I'll take my prize. Yes, the prize is mine. No, he should have been mine. Why are you doing this to me? Don't worry, Mikey. You'll win next time. I think there will be all sorts of contests. <laughs> I'm the first one to win. Congratulations to you, JJ. Very cool. But I would need a prize more. My family needs protection, too. But I'm still happy for you. Mikey is right. I already live in a rich village. And he lives in a small house. Maybe I should share it with him. There's enough for everyone here. I think this will be the right decision. We must help each other, even with jewelry. Otherwise, it will be wrong. I'm sure Mikey would have done the same thing in my place. He would have shared the winnings with me. Hey, Mikey. Come here to me. I want to share my winnings with you. JJ, is this true for me? Are you kidding me? We are Mikey's friends. Now you can live with us in a rich village with protection, and nothing will offend your family anymore. It's just the best day ever. Yes, Mikey. There are good moments in life.